I'm Kimberly Trapani, executive producer, director, and the visionary for All Consuming Film. All Consuming Film is about the heartbreaking effects of illegal drug addiction and the overprescription of pills. What you have to remember is they're, they're implementing programs in New York State for heroin addicts to have a safe haven. I don't know if that's a good thing or bad thing, but they're trying to raise awareness in New York State to heroin addicts that, you know, they're trying to give them a safe haven to, you know, I want I don't like to say it, but to do the drug. No, no, say it. You know, but, you know, yeah, I mean, I don't get it. Yeah. Spike up. Right. Let, let, let's monitor you and, yeah. you know, but, yeah, great. So let, to me, that is just, you're allowing it to happen and you're not, you're not fixing the problem. Yeah. You're contributing to the problem by giving them a safe haven. We are not judging you as an addict or you as an enabler or you as a family member. It conveys a path of hope and wellness and a better life and a journey of success. You do not need to be on the path of destruction. You need a life of happiness, wellness, and love from your family members and a fruitful life, there is a way out. It's like a pit of, of hell and it, it's scary. Her manager was the one that hired me to tour with Vesta, sing background with Vesta. And we were on the road with the Jackson Five. We were on the road with the Jacksons. And um, I got a chance to travel and see the whole United States. It, it was just like a dream come true. It was like a dream. And then from there, oh man, I, I, I was in Boys in the Hood, the movie, the famous gangster movie i was an extra in the movie and um i man i can go down the list all the people i work with bobby brown and ralph tresden from the group new edition i used to sing usher demos i used to sing ray j demos so my shot I, it was hard to say because i've had so many people to influence me in in my life i, I it, it's 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 really, really like a dream come true. A kid, young kid growing up in South Central Los Angeles. And um, I got a chance to see the world. And I'm going to put it out there. I don't drink. I don't smoke. I don't get high. Never have. You know, and, and I think that got me to a lot of places. And my shots go out to, man, I, I Gerald Busby, you know, I, it, He's deceased, you know, you know, even, um, man, I, I, there's so many people that, you know, that I can give a shout out to that helped me, you know, along the way. Um, I sung, I sung with the Miracles, 
You know, I, I, they were like my uncles. I, Sydney got me to sing with them. Um, but the funny thing about it is I never met Smokey Robinson. Isn't that something? I never met Smokey Robinson, but I work with, I've worked with all the miracles. You know, I sung with David Ruffin, Eddie Kendrick. You know, when I was younger, before they passed away, they were funny as hell. Excuse my language. <laughs> they were funny. <laughs> But I, 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 like I said, I got a chance to, oh my God, I, I, I can just go down the list. Even James Brown pulled my coattail and schooled me on things. And um, Yes, we talked about James Brown before in our yeah. hall, shout out. 